Political heat is on in the East Bay. First, it was the Alameda County District Attorney. Now, a recall effort for Oakland Mayor Sheng Tao. Organizers say they have more than enough signatures to do it, and they plan to file the paperwork tomorrow. NBC Bayer's Jocelyn Moran joins us now with the details for that. Yeah, you know, residents say they are fed up. Behind this, the residents, they tell us they are not only fed up with crime in the city of Oakland, but the lack of a police chief, the recent shooting of Officer Lay, and the city dropping the ball on the grant to combat retail theft. Organizers and volunteers were gathering signatures in the Montclair neighborhood tonight, and they say people showed up. I feel that uh, Mayor Tao is, is derelict in her duties as a, uh, as a leader. Sean Parkin has lived in Oakland for 15 years. He also owns a commercial property near Jack London Square. Our commercial building has been burglarized, um, I think, five times in 2023. 20, uh, and it costs us a really significant amount of money each time. He wants change, so tonight he volunteered to collect signatures. He posted on next door that he would be in the Mont Claire neighborhood and one by one residents showed up, including Loretta Sansusi, an Oakland native. We asked her why she came tonight. She pointed to the lack of response from Tao's office when concerns are brought up and not having a police chief. I think people are just about had it. They can't they can't tolerate this anymore. We've got our small businesses that are suffering. They keep getting attacked over and over again. Different communities are getting attacked over and over again. The most vulnerable. We looked at some of the stats in Oakland. Robbery increased by 38% from 2022 to 2023. Burglaries increased by 23%. Motor vehicle thefts increased by 45%. We're in the notice of intent phase. Seneca Scott, who is a member of the NAACP Oakland chapter, is one of the organizers of this recall effort. He also ran for mayor in 2022. They've been collecting signatures over the last couple of days. We have been down in East Mont Mall. We have been in Chinatown. We have been in West Oakland. Well, in the last hour, we heard from the mayor's office who says they have no comment on the recall effort. Organizers tell us they need 250 signatures to submit this notice of intention. They tell us they have more than enough. It is important to note, though, the notice of intention is just the first step in this long process. But tonight, it seems like that process is well underway. They plan on submitting tomorrow. Raj. Jocelyn, thank you.